Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of The Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lamb. Um, this video is actually happening now, and it's the 23rd, well technically it's the 24th now since it's midnight, but um, this one's going to be a little bit different because I have already recorded this, obviously, because I'm not playing right now, um, but I'm going to be commenting on it, and right now I recorded the whole thing, I'm just going to comment on like what's going on, and um, I'm going to cut it up and everything, like, just so you don't have to watch an hour and ten minute video, but anyway, I'm starting as Maggie, I'm going to pick up the key right there, um, I don't know why I'm standing right there, that's really weird, maybe so I can talk right now to you guys, how's it going? Sorry there's a glare in my glasses, um, the only way I can really, like, break on my face is to have the screen really bright, and it's, it's a glare on my glasses, but I hope that doesn't bother you guys as much. Anyway, um, one of the main reasons why I play as Maggie a lot, if you watch my other videos, or I don't know if you really notice that in the ones that I've uploaded, but... I really, really like Maggie because she's the first character I beat the game with. Like, initially, not the whole game. The whole game, the first character I beat with was Judas, ironically, which is like one of the hardest players to beat the game with. I'm gonna go in that treasure room and get, um, what the heck is that? Stigmata. Oh, that makes your damage and health go, obviously. It says it right there. But, um, yeah. I like Maggie because she comes with the yum heart, which, like, Health is my biggest issue because I get hit all the time. And the fact that she has the other and when it recharges, you can recharge a whole heart. Like, that's really big for me. And she starts with four hearts. So, like, you can instantly, after one round, get a uh, devil room and sacrifice two hearts and only three left. So, I think that's, like, one of the best things because there's a lot of really cool items in the devil room. But, um, it's really cool, and, I don't know, um, so in this room, I'm fighting Famine, here's the second form or whatever, um, Famine's not really that hard even though I just got hit twice, um, I mean, as far as the horsemen go, I don't mind any of them really, it's just, like, I've only... Like, you get a cube of meat for all of them, except for the Headless Horseman, which gives you a pony, which makes you have flight and everything, and you get, you lose your space item for that. But, um, I like the cube of meat, if you can get it to be a meat boy, and I've only, I think I might have gotten it once. Bombs are key, makes your bombs are the key, it's like your number if you saw that. And then balls of steel gives you two, uh, soul hearts. But, um, the cube is cool, but, like, because it blocks damage, and when you get two of them, you get a, a rotating head. Oh, the ank, I forgot, that's in this, uh, in this run. Basically what it does, I, uh, spoiler alert, so, if you want to skip ahead, um, what it does is, when you die, you come back as... I've heard people call them different names, but... Question mark, question mark, question mark, which is... Some people call him Blue Baby. It's basically like Isaac's doll or something. And basically he only has soul hearts, so when you lose a heart, you lose that whole heart. But, in that respect, when you get help up, you get another soul heart. So it's a good and a bad thing, but you can't regenerate health. So as Maggie, if I were to become question mark, question mark, question mark, blue baby, whatever, blue baby's a cool set. Um, the young heart won't work at all. Like I won't regain it. Like I won't regain the heart because it's a soul heart. But I think it's a really cool item, like in general, because you come back, but once you die, it's him. You die. But you can get achievements for him, which is cool. So, like, if I die in shield, I can get the shield achievements. Um, this is Guppy's head. Guppy's head basically gives you 
bunch of flies, which is really cool, and I like that item, but not as Maggie. Like, I'll stick with the soul heart, or the, the soul heart, the um heart as Maggie. I'm just gonna blow this up because I don't have, um, coins, but normally I would play it, like, until I don't have any coins left. I can't believe I ran out of the bomb. But, um, I really like having Guppy's head because there's one run that I have. It might be. I might be one that I have recorded, but, um, Guppy's head is really cool because every single room you need to recharge, so every room you go into, you can put more flies out that, like, protect you and hold you up other enemies, which is the false, and I love that creature. Oh, there's a nickel right there, which gives you five cents. Um, but yeah, the one thing I hate is going through an entire floor and you see the treasure room, because you can see the treasure room right there, but I don't have a key, and I know I cleared every single room, and there's no way I can get in that treasure room. It's just, it's such a defeating feeling because you lose an item that way. Like, I hope this is if you guys don't know, uh... Edmund's remaking it for consoles and remaking it for this, for PC and Mac, obviously. And um, it's gonna be in 16 bit, which is a different style than this, obviously, but um, it's gonna have a lot more stuff in it. It's gonna have co op in it. And I'm really, really waiting for that. I can't really get it. But it's looking like it's not gonna come out for a while, obviously. Like that and take a while to develop. Um, Black Widow bothers me. Um, I mean, obviously, I didn't have much trouble there, but like, there's certain variations of bosses that like I have trouble with, and like, it takes me forever to get past them. Like, like sometimes I'll be stuck in a boss room for like five minutes, and I'm like, how am I gonna upload this on the YouTube? Because I spent five minutes shooting in a boss and missing the whole time. But, um, yeah, sorry if this is all shaky. I'm sitting at an end table. Also, I hate these guys. I call them the human centipedes because they look like they're eating each other's butts. Um, because they're so unpredictable. Like, that's why I got hit, like, three times right there. I mean, I'm sure there's a pattern, like, in Pac-Man, the ghosts have, like, a pattern or whatever, but I haven't figured it out yet. Uh, oh, those, these guys aren't a problem for me, unless they can gang up on you, which sucks. The cool thing about them is you can trick them to, like, shoot, uh, like, one of their blasty things in the wall. Like, if I got them to shoot up there, there could be a secret room there, which they probably is. <laughs> that, I don't know how the hell that happened. I don't know how I opened a secret room with a TNT crate. I just realized that that happened. I didn't realize that that happened in the game. Like, I mean, obviously I'm gonna go in there. I'm not stupid. But I mean, I don't even remember opening it. Uh, but like this, like, it's just all idle time. Like, I'm just trying to get this one guy and I feel like an idiot. <laughs> but, uh, I hate when you go into the secret room and you get an item to So like, I'll just use it for you. Cause obviously I'm gonna keep my yum heart, like I said already. Like, as Maggie, I'll keep the yum heart unless I get like, a super cool item. Like that mom's pad, I just wasted a key. Which, I'm gonna use mom's pad, just so you see it. But, I hate getting items that... I'm not gonna have a use for, like, I don't know. It's nice going into a, a treasure room and finding something, like, as Maggie, that will help, like, something that shit's like, oh, damage up, or health up, or, like, I don't know. I have to be honest, though, um, the heart, which is, like, the equals and the less than, equals, or not equals, three less than, Three greater than whatever the heart 
item is probably my favorite item, even though it, all it does is it gives you a heart and it fills your health. It saved my ass so many times and I haven't recorded any videos where it has because it was during my period of like, I uh, let it just practice this game because if you watch some of my earlier videos pre DLC, um, I'm, just, I'm terrible at this game. I have no idea what some items do and I, I'm just terrible. Like, it's painful to watch. Um, but I mean, now I definitely feel like I'm a lot better at this game. And I hope you guys feel that way too. I hope you guys are entertained. And also, I hope you guys enjoy this. Like, this style. I don't know if I'm going to keep doing this. I mean, it's, a, it's probably going to be a lot easier for me to record and then dub. Dub over it? Yeah, dub over it. Then, for me to record and, like, record my actions and my reactions. Oh, gluttony. China monster. Um, I mean, I like recording my voice over it, but like, file becomes so huge when I'm recording an hour long. Like, this, this is honestly a lot easier for me to do. I hope I'm not rambling too much for you guys. Um, the one thing I do know that I do by doing this form as opposed to recording simultaneously my voice and the game is that you don't get my reactions. Like you don't get my rage quit at the end when I get killed or you don't get like, oh my god, this is such a cool item. Like you lose out on that. Like I would freak out this room. But like I don't know, it's a lot easier for me. Let me know in the comments if you like this style, because I do talk a lot more this way, obviously, because I haven't stopped talking. But, um, uh, I hope you guys like it. And I'm actually... I think after this boss fight, I'm going to stop it. So, I mean, I stopped, I guess, to tell you guys that. <laughs> but, uh, oh, the husk. This guy's kind of like a flies, but he shoots out blood too. So basically he spits out flies at him and kind of throws up into the monster. Uh, I hate when they shoot spiders too. So spiders are like the bane of my existence because they're, like flies are predictable. They're like, they buzz around a little bit, but spiders they like stop and then they scoop towards you. Like, I hate them. But yeah. Um. I don't know. Just, I don't know what I'm even saying now. The thing that I hate about the, the husk and um, Lord of Flies is they're easy, essentially. But the fact that you shoot out so many flies, like, you're busy taking out flies rather than, like, taking them out. And you can't even, like, be like, ooh, let me just take him out first because there's so many flies. Like, like, right now there's not many, but it, it can get really, 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 really good. Especially with him, since he shoots stuff. There, I just, I find it cool. Not that I have it. A little ball sack for us. <laughs> oh, get that heart and get the max max up. Where am I going? Did I miss something? Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go grab that heart that I missed in the gluttony room. Look at me, past me being smart. Oh, there's two. That's right. Um, I could go in there. I do go in there. Oh, and the map. I had to grab the map because it was on sale. That's what the red means, if you guys don't know. Just to give you guys a tip. The the little red symbol, like when you get the Steam sale, which makes everything 50% off, everything turns red, which makes every every single item 50% off of what it is, obviously. But um I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I hope you guys liked the style. And I'm going to end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. 
you, if you did, please leave me a like. If you could, that would be great. Leave me a comment. If you have anything to say about it, if you like this style, let me know, please. If you don't, if you want me to do it the other way, let me know, too. And, as always, subscribe if you want to see more videos. That would help me a great deal. And, I'll see you guys next, next time that I do another video, which should be soon since I'm on winter break, you know. Got nothing else to do, really. Um... Yeah, look forward to seeing you guys soon. Take care.